Hi everyone. So, drum roll please, because we've reached number one on the list of people I wish I had known and met and known and met. Um, when I was making this list, she was the first person I dropped into it and I put her down as number one straight away. I wish I had known her. She was born in 1900 and died in 1960, far too young. And it was my grandmother, Morag Murray Abdullah was her pen name. She was Scottish and her real name was Elizabeth Mackenzie. It was her who met at a um, fundraising tea party, met my grandfather, the Soda Iqbal Ali Shah, in Edinburgh in 1917. And they eloped to the Hindu Kush and had the most extraordinary life together. She wrote two books and I cherish them. One of them is called um, My Khyber Marriage and it's still in print and another is called The Valley of the Giant Buddhas about Afghanistan. She is really in our family a kind of guiding light and my mother who was never easily impressed with anyone um, said that Bobo, we all call her Bobo, my mother said that Bobo was quite simply the most practical good person she had ever met. Um, there are so many stories about her but I think the thing I think about most is the fact that when she died of cancer in 1960 she left such an enormous hole in the life of my grandfather Iqbal Ali Shah that he moved to Tangier to live alone for the last 10 years of his life and he moved there because as he said it was a place where they had never been together so he had no memories of being there with her and um, that was the only way he could get through life. So number one, the number one person I wish I had met, Morag Mariam Dullah, my grandmother, Elizabeth Mackenzie.